Nine News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update, and currently we've got a little bit of a mixed bag out here. You've got the uh, all the indices trading lower with the exception of the Dow transports. They're up about three points, so they're flat. The Dow is off 21, S&P 10, two-tenths of a percent. NASDAQ's off 103, seven-tenths of a percent. The big loser to the downside, the semi's off nearly one full percentage point, 29 points. You've got gold up 11 bucks, silver's up a penny, lightsweet crude is off 87 cents. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We'll begin by looking at the ES Mini. As we do that in the upper left-hand corner, what you should notice is that there's a new profile that is attempting to form. It is bullish in structure. It says, as we speak, no charts, I'm not sure, boy. The, uh, I've got my charts up on the screen. Production room will just have to uh, get that up there, Mr. Bill. Sorry about that. Not sure what's going on. But let me explain to you what's happening. And that is that the ES Mini has a brand new daily profile that is attempting to form. It is bullish in structure. So on any move lower, you would be looking for support between 44.07 and 44.21. Now, although you don't see it, <laughs> I'm telling you that they are sharing with you certainly that the profile is there and I'm using Stevie's advanced Doppler tool. So we won't have a confirmation of this profile till this evening, but it has been in place pretty much since Sunday. So I'm thinking this one is going to stay. The spot volatile next, what it did earlier in the day was it tested and rejected the 50 day exponential moving average, the 50 days at 1749. Spot volatility right now trading at 16.55. The NQ has consolidated with inside its daily profile. That's all the way up to a high of 15.136. That's the top of the profile. And the low is 14.919. The actual low today, 14.917. So you've just got a good old-fashioned consolidation inside of the NQ. The U.S. dollar index, as we pointed out on Friday, even though it was moving lower uh, quite a bit, it found support at the bottom of its daily profile, and that level is 92.41. That's a key area to watch and observe. If price closes below that, you're looking at a move down to about 92. The question about gold, it's got a valid bottom. Now, when I say a valid bottom, it made a buy the D point. However, there's a profile that formed last week, and it was above price. Price has tested and rejected that so far, and that's at 1786. We're trading right now at 1786.40. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. We'll make sure we get these charts up here on the uh, screen for you. If you're off to start your Monday, have a magnificent one. We'll look forward to seeing you soon. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be